Hello, Game of Thrones. This is our Game of Thrones here today. In this video, we are going to see how you can create or develop a program so that it can tell whether a number is even or odd, whether a number is positive or negative. So let's do this, guys. Let's create a program which will tell us about those things. Okay, let's start it. First of all, we need to declare a variable in which a number is going to store. Now we have to print some message so that user can input a number. User can know what we, what he or she had to input. Uh, input a number. Simple. Input a number. Input a number. Now we have to store this input in the variable a. Okay. Yeah, yes, that's right. Now we have to use the decision making statements if else statement as I told about these statements. If you don't know about these statements, then you can check out my tutorials. C tutorial in which you will find if tutorial and else tutorial. So uh, in this condition thing we have to write for even if we divide any even number by 2 we get remainder as anybody can tell about it it's remainder 0 of course so if the numbers remainder when it is divided by 2 is equals to 0 then the number is even number is even And else on the else part you don't need to write the condition as if this condition is not going to true then it will come on this else part and it will print sorry I forgot to write the <laughs> these marks these are very important don't ever forget to write these things guys that's what Number is odd. Let's run it. F11. Compile and run. Input a number. 7 for example. Number is odd. F11. 6. Number is even. That's how this program works. Now let's create a program which will tell you whether the input number is negative, positive or zero. Let's do it. That's the game of if else statements. If a equals to zero, the number is zero. Else if if now a condition if a is less than uh, zero, number is negative. Now on the else part, you don't need to write the else if if you want. You can write inside that. You can write a condition if uh, else if a is greater than zero. Then a message uh, number is positive. Now save it. F11. Compile and run. Input a number. Okay, let's try out 7. Number is positive. F11. 0. Number is 0. F11. Minus 4. Number is negative. That's how this program works. That's how. Uh, that's the magic of if else statements, guys. Well, I hope you understood how you can develop these kind of program, these kind of simple program. If you have any uh, kind of doubt, in these simple if else programs then you can ask me in the comment section below if you have any doubt in these two programs then you can also ask me in the comment section below well thanks for watching the video and don't forget to subscribe to my channel don't forget to hit that red button for getting updates uh, don't forget to hit that bell icon for getting notified on my videos on my youtube channel thank you guys